All right, guys, uh, I'm gonna record this for you. Uh, we were talking on the forum about the F1 pump. I just left this aluminum foil in there. I just pushed it down a little bit to get the last nut. I know that a lot of guys are t pulling this out and maybe it would have made it a little easier, but it didn't really seem bothered because you got to bend it all back in anyway. So um, let me show you the new motor. Well, it's got a little dirt on it. Sorry about that. And let me just show you. Let me zoom into it so you can see the numbers and see that it is a new style motor. Um, numbers and let me just show you the body style too you see it's got this fat body style here okay so what we want to find out is um, I'm just gonna I'm gonna show you the alligator clips that I'm using I've got them protected with rubber, insula rubber insulation so it goes right down over the prongs and the plug uh, the problems that, that I'm having is this is a new style motor it was replaced in November and it's only July, eight or nine months, and the motor obviously is bad. Um, I don't know if maybe, let me see if there's any markings on the motor. There's some engravings on the motor too. I don't know if you wanna see those. Uh, if it'll come in. Uh, I don't know if that helps you or not. Anyway, so what I'm gonna do, pick this up. Um, let me see. I'm gonna show you what it actually reads when we hook it up to the amp meter. So let me flip this all the way up. And we're gonna put this down, select it to DC. So you can see. So it's running to DC, I'm gonna zero it out. Well, it didn't zero, it was not zeroing out. Either way, so I'm gonna put this on max. We're gonna need it on max. And it's gonna show you two things. It's gonna show you the digital screen here, but down below, I don't know if you can see the bar. Let me zoom right in on that. Now what we're gonna do is, I'm gonna put this right through here. And the reason why I'm doing that is so it can read it. I'm gonna hook it to this battery. And you're gonna hear the motor dip down. And you're gonna hear the change in the RPM. And when it dips down, you're gonna see this peg. So I tried it a couple times already, hopefully it's Let's see if we can do it where you can just see it right away. So that's what it's running at, 24, right? You see it start to climb. There it goes. You see it max out and go past 40. And the motor, the motor's not even barely running anymore. And I just smoke. You see the smoke coming off the wires. Ah, oh, that's hot. <laughs> so... That's what it's doing. Um, there's the max. So it went right off uh, 40 so that you would know what it was running. Um, I hope this video helps the guys that were asking about it, wondering about what exactly was going on. And as you as you can see, it's, it's obviously, it's, it's under no load. And it's still doing it. All right, I appreciate it guys. I hope that helped out.